star child. I never. Never seen the sun shine like this. I never. Never seen the moon glow like this. Hey yo, I never. Never seen the waterfalls like this. I never. Never seen the lights up like this. I never. Gilly the Kid went full ape sh on bloggers, podcasters, and black people in general. He said that he was sick and tired of the way black people express themselves when other blacks get gunned down in the streets. The first thing that you see is them got phones, and he's sick and tired of it. So he took the social media, and he expressed his feelings in full view. And in my opinion, I can't give you my opinion right now, but I'll give you my opinion at the end of the video. But I want to know, do you think Gilly the Kid was right in what he said about black people, or was he dead wrong? Now let's see what Gilly the Kid had to say. Why every time something happened to a rapper or an athlete or an entertainer or anybody of color, the first thing you niggas do is pull your fucking phones out and start recording and post that shit on the internet, man. You niggas is clowns for that shit, man. Y'all niggas is clowns for that shit, man. The last image a motherfucker want to see is they people's laying on the ground bleeding the fuck out, man. Niggas be having mamas, kids, grandmamas, uncles, aunties. That's some dumb shit, man. But the first thing y'all niggas do is pull your phone out. Ooh, look at such and such. Man, that shit ain't cool, man. For real, man. You niggas, that nigga just lost his life and you niggas is trying to get likes. Tell me how that shit add up, man. You niggas, all you blog sites, y'all niggas is out of pocket, man. Y'all niggas be trying to get clickbait, you niggas is suckers, man. That man laying on the ground, he bleeding out, and niggas recording it and posting that shit on the internet, man. Y'all niggas is clowns for that shit. I, I'm telling you, man, this the reason why I be hating niggas, man. I'm telling you, man. It just be us. It, it, I be hating niggas, man. Shout out to fucking Take Off, man. Rest in peace, man. Shout out to his family, man. We sent our condolences to y'all for a million dollars worth of game, man. Shout out to QC. Shout out to P. Shout out to Coach, the Migos, everybody, man. Hold y'all head, man. But y'all niggas got to stop that shit, man. That shit is not cool, man. Rest in peace, man. Take Off, man. Love you, Neff. First, I'm going to say blessings to the young brother at Take Off. And secondly... I give my condolences to the family, especially his mother, and that me and my family will be praying for you. But now it's time to put in work. Definitely, I agree with Gilly the Kid that these people out here, black people, we lame for that. It's definitely some clown shit and some lame shit to be pulling out your phone and recording a man as he takes his last breath. And to be clout chasing for views and subscribers on social media when it comes to one of your brothers, especially for you old heads, when it comes to your young brother. You need to be motivating the situation. You need to be adding some real substance to the situation and not being a lame talking all the rah-rah while we on social media, but really, it's lame. With that, I'm definitely going to give my thumbs up to Gilly the Kid and tell him, speak your speech. And with that, I'm going to say this is the news in you. North, east, west, south, unite from every alley in Cali, intersection and back street. Subscribe to the channel and hit the thumbs up on your way out the door.